Hello, I'm Radioactive Duck, and it's Final Fantasy Friday. So we are going to go to our quick save. Um, the last time you, in the last video, I kind of ended things off on the moon. However, I went through the cavern. I didn't open any chests or get any secrets or anything, but I just went through um, as far as I could go. A couple times um, and then I would teleport out just to just to grind some levels so I have leveled up to let's see where we're at here level 56 58 59 58 59 um, which isn't terrible um, we're gonna see so we're, we're back here at Baron because we're gonna see if we can go get Odin not that I don't know I've never really used Odin so much, but I am a slightly a completionist. Um, there, there have been times in the past where I've had to get every single secret, every, do every single, every single thing. Um, but we're gonna try to get it anyways. Like I have never really used Odin, but you know, maybe there's something in this Pixel Remaster. Maybe there's like a point for it. I don't know. Ooh bunch of treasures um let's see what's up here first i have a feeling there's gonna be more treasure um so high potion high potion let's finally use them um i also could have swore that there was a Oh, we got some ethers. I thought there was a secret up here, but apparently not. Okay. Anyways, um, one of the things that I lost my train. I thought one of the things I'm going to do is, um, I absolutely lost my train of thought. Anyways, um, so I am excited for, now don't get me wrong, I love Final Fantasy 4, this is my favorite Final Fantasy. I'm kind of excited for it to be over though. Like we're, we're kind of at that end point, um, because I'm excited to play other Final Fantasy games. So I'm going to play one through six, I think. Um, I'm going to play six next and then I, I should have gone in order. I should have played one. You know, like, I should have started at the beginning, and, and I didn't. Um, I'm just going to play them in order of, like, my favorite. I don't know. So, you have returned. Yeah, I have. I have completely forgotten how to beat this guy. I have forgotten everything. So, we'll see how this goes. Your Majesty... I do not need your pity. Although I have been slain, I have been given eternal power. The summoner that follows you will be able to call upon me whenever my help is required. How convenient. Call on my sword and it will be yours. However, you must earn my respect by proving your strength and courage. Let us begin the battle. I mean, it's great that the king has turned into Odin, but um, we're going to attack. Um, attack, jump, summon Bahamut, and then, shit, um, cure her up. Yeah, I have no idea how to beat him, so it's been a while. Oh, well, there you go. That was um, easier than I remember it being, so hooray. <laughs> so I'm curious now. You have grown strong. You're damn right I have. Now you must use that strength to protect Baron and the world. I shall fight along with you as Odin. Thank you, your majesty. That's kind of creepy. But okay, Rydia has learned Odin. Yep. Good to know that in death he became a monster. Alright, moving on. Let's go back to the moon.
and we will wander that cavern and get all the secrets and then we'll go fight the uh the final boss i'm sure this will take more than one video but you know all right Let us get out of here. So it's actually been a while since I've played anything. Um, well, I shouldn't say a while. It's It's been like a week, a little over a week. I um, took a road trip back to my home state of Wisconsin and I may make a video about it. Um, I like the idea of kind of documenting the things that I was feeling and thinking. Um, my hometown is a neat, neat place, and it was interesting to view it as a tourist. It's, it's actually kind of, I don't want to say a tourist trap. It is, growing up, um, I lived in one of those historic towns where the buildings are all in the National Registry and preserved and it was sort of like a draw for tourists. Um, there's like a chamber of commerce and there's a like tourism board and everything. Um, we're gonna save this. Anyways, growing up there it was just like the place that you live, right? But, you know, n now I've sort of experienced it as a as a tourist which is interesting um so it's fun but i didn't uh even though i brought my laptop and thought that i was gonna play some video games um i didn't <laughs> so it was one of those things where you just get caught up in what you're doing um but anyway it was nice i just so i haven't played uh recently um but I'm excited to get back into it. Like I said, I'm really excited to finish this. Um, Final Fantasy IV is an amazing game, and while it is my favorite, it's my favorite for nostalgia purposes. Um, Final Fantasy VI is really, I think, the best game. I'm not going to say the best game in the series because I have not played Beyond Seven. Um, I've only played up to seven. I don't know why. Um, I'm sure that there are... Um, let's see what Odin does. Anyways. Zanetsuken? It did nothing. Good. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Anyways. Um... I'm sure that there are other games beyond Seven that are amazing, but it seems, it's just, it's a lot, and it's intimidating. I don't want to say it's intimidating, but like, I think about like playing all of the games in order, and it makes me tired. Um, so it's like one of those things where I, I don't think I ever will. Um, I think I'm happy with these. You know, all of these games are, I shouldn't say all of them. Many of these games are very good. Um, Final Fantasy IV is a classic, it's amazing. Final Fantasy VI, I think, is one of the best games ever made. Um, like, not just Final Fantasy, like one of the best video games ever made. So I'm excited to play that. Um, after VI, I think I'm gonna go do five, And then we'll do like three, two, one. Um, I'm not a big fan of the first one. I, mean, I shouldn't say not a big fan. It is it is my least favorite. Um, it is grindy and difficult, and I remember getting super... And I've never actually beaten it, and I remember getting super frustrated all the time when I would try to play it. Um, I am told that the Pixel Remaster has sort of... Uh, added like a... Um, we're, we're, we're using it in the Sailor Moon game, in like an XP, like, uh, XP mod, so that you're not grinding the entire time, but 
We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. I actually haven't played it in probably 10 years. I should probably attack. Alright, let's cure everybody. Uh oh. Well. Yay. In any case, um, let's go refresh. We'll heal everybody up. We'll, uh, get more magic. Alright, everybody's healed. Let's restore our magic and then let's head to the core. All right. This floor is really weird. Is it like stone or is it flesh or is it like magma? I don't know. Anyways. Now, I even though I just like went through <laughs> went through this to level up a bunch. Um I don't remember where anything is. So we're just going to try to wing it. <gasps> Ambushed, oh no. Um, I don't think we need to use magic. I think we can just... I mean, I mean with Rydia. Um, we don't need to use any collar or black magic. We can just... Oh, I'm having a memory. I think in the original um, American game, final when, when it was branded as Final Fantasy II, I think Rita was a summoner, not a or no 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 no. I think she was a caller, not a summoner. Anyways, um, I don't know why I'm thinking about that. I am remembering back to that game, and I'm pretty sure that she was. A caller. Oh, we did come through here, didn't we? Um, well, we'll keep going because I don't remember what's what. There's a cat on my desk where he's not supposed to be, and um, I can't do anything about it because I'm in my bed with my laptop, and um, you know, he's if if he misbehaves, which I can hear him doing. <sighs> I can hear him. So I'm gonna have to get up and fix that. <sighs> I love him, but he's an asshole sometimes. I hear you, cat. Oh, and now he's just like looking at me like, yeah, there's nothing you can do about it. Alright. I'm gonna pause and deal with the nuisance. And we're back. Okay. Oh, what a jerk. Anyways. Anyways. Let's, uh... Okay, I think we went through this way. I honestly, I'm sorry if this is a, um, a repeat of, of places we've been. It might be. I just gotta double check. Oh, I should have healed Rydia, but that's okay. Um. Maybe we teleport out if, uh, oh, that was a good, that was a good one. Man, Rosa, bring in the offense. Okay, so maybe if we've been this way before, um, we will, oh, we have, okay. We did that last time. Um, let's, do I want to teleport out? Nah, 
we'll just we'll just go back. Maybe we will teleport out. <laughs> Hi, potion. And then... White magic. We'll heal everybody. So I'm really curious... Oh, that was fine. I'm really curious how Odin works. I never knew why I played when I was young, and I still don't know now. So... I know how Odin is supposed to work, and I know how he works in other games. Ah, uh, no, we'll teleport out. All right. Oops, magic. Emergency exit. Let's get out of here. And we will go back in, heal everybody, replenish our magic power once again. All right. MP restored. Does it restore all of it? It does. Okay, good. I assumed that it did, but... You know, I've, I've gone in battle before using a tent, and the tent, you know, at this point, does not replenish everything. So, all right, let's go the other direction. Um, we'll see what we find. I know there's another secret somewhere. What's, how do I get out there? I don't remember. Um... I could have swore that there were three... Oops, that's not what I want to do. I could have swore that there were three directions that you could go in this first, like, chamber. But apparently I'm wrong. Goodbye. Okay, um, is there something down here? I guess we'll go this way. I guess. I, I could have swore there was another, another way to go, but I guess we'll find out. Um, jump. White magic. Summon. All right. That flamethrower is a lot more menacing than it looks. Hooray! Level up for Rosa and Edge. Ah, oh, and Cecil, nice. Okay, so some of the characters are at 60. All right, let's check out this flame whip. I think that goes to her. All right. Ambushed. <gasps> oh no. I'll just attack. I'm basically just gonna use Bahamut, um, forever. <laughs> That's what's gonna happen. Oops. Kiraga. Oh, well, doesn't matter, I guess. Goodbye. And now Riddy is leveled up. Excellent. Okay. Alrighty, let's continue on. Now we've been that way before. Um, I think that chest is a monster, but I could be wrong.
I could be wrong. Okay. I feel like now's a good time to take a break. We'll open this chest in the next one. And so, adios.